What is the most nutrient dense legume we can eat? Oh, I don't know. I don't think it's soy. It might be lentils. I feel like lentils are highest. We should look, well, let's look it up. Okay. I'm placing my bets. I'm going to place my bets on like a, a whole lentil, like a green lentil. Uh, but I don't think I'm going to be right because there's so many different kinds. That's what I'm going to place my bets on. And now I'm going to look it up. I was so close. Lentils are second. I was ah! the most nutrient dense legume is adzuki beans. They have a Nutriver score of 576, which is extremely high for a starchy food. And lentils are second with a Nutriver score of 489, still super high. And then third is chickpeas, garbanzo beans with a Nutriver score of 454. And then fourth is black beans with a Nutriver score of 446. And then fifth is broad beans, AKA fava beans, which you know we all enjoy with a nice Chianti with a Nutriver score of 442. So then tempeh as, as a, a soy product, 438. Um, so yeah, adzuki beans, which are also really pretty. Like they're, they're one of the prettiest, prettiest beans, I feel like. And one that I never think to get. But then lentils and chickpeas and black beans, all like really easy, cheap, affordable, easy to find at any grocery store legumes. And they're all like those, those Nutriver scores are basically like double to triple the Nutriver scores of most whole grains uh, and in uh, double to like same range for root vegetables as well. So those are, those are really impressive uh, nutrient density as uh, for, for like any starchy food. So all of them are good options. It's like, I think what I'm trying to say.